Hello, this video is in uh, is part of an article that we're going to write all you need to know about calamaris. I just told you the tip of cheap hearted, but there is also another tip. And it's hidden away, you have to know it to be, well, to, to, to use it, of course, it's knowledge is power, as usual. But I'm sharing our knowledge, so Arco Linux, d.com, it's hidden away. I'm still on the live CD, so it's uh, all pretty for me. And I have an SRT keyboard, so a bit tricky. But it's if you know where it is, it's all in the Archway installation. In there, there's um, a way to actually clean up your system, to zap your thing. Um, let's have a look at the code. There are two codes you can try. If installation is not successful, and you have issues, that's the point of the videos. There is this wipe file system, and then the other one is SGDisk. So these two guys are two ways to actually clean up your system. So assuming Gpart that did not work, it's available here. You can have a look at Ctrl T. Well, maybe we should take a look, Eric. Gpart it, open it up. So this, there is a partition, it actually contains Arch Linux, right? And um, we're gonna make sure it's it's not this color anymore, it's not partitioned anymore. So if we ask ls block, give me what's what you have, then there is indeed a SDA hard disk with a partition on it. Okay, um, what should I do? Wipe FS, okay, wipe FS. Probably gonna be pseudo, but since we are now um, on an ISO where we have already that permission, all these QWERTY things. Okay, there you are. Wipe FS, and then the minus is here, the A is there, slash is here, device slash SDA. Yeah, that's it. So, probing initialization file permission denied. Fine, let's do for, let's go for a pseudo anyway then. And there you go, it's gone. Mm -hmm. Success, it says. So I'm going to check with my visual aid. And that's what we need to have. Something grayish. If it's grayish, it means it's an empty hard disk. It has never been touched. It's coming straight from the shop. It has no partitions, no formatation, anything. So this is the real thing. Now you can install any Linux system. It shouldn't be a problem. All right. Enjoy.